Let's do number 57. It says, the length of a rectangular storage room is four feet longer than its width. If the area of the room is 60 square feet, find its dimensions. Okay, let's draw a picture. So it says the length um, is four feet longer than its width. So it's probably gonna look like this. And then, so we need to give the width a name, so I'll call it W. And then the length is four feet longer than its width. So this piece here is the length, so it'll be uh, four plus W, right? Four feet longer than the width, so four plus W. And this here is four plus W. So our length is equal to four plus W. That's our length, I'll go ahead and write it down. And then W is equal to our width. Okay, and it says, if the area of the room is 60 square feet, find its dimension. So we're given the area, so to find the area, you just multiply, right? So you do length times width. So it'll be four plus W times W. So four plus W times W, this is the area and we're told it's 60, so equals 60. And the question is to find the dimensions. So we have to find the length and the width. So I guess now we can just solve this for w. So we can multiply the w through. So distribute, so we get 4w plus w squared, and that's equal to 60. We can write this as w squared plus 4w equals 60, just to rearrange the terms. And this is a quadratic equation, so whenever you have a quadratic equation and you're trying to solve it, just um, you can set it equal to zero and try to factor. So this is w squared plus 4w minus 60, and now this whole thing here is equal to zero. And this should factor. Um, let, let's try it. So this is w, w, and this is equal to zero. So we need two numbers um, that multiply to 60 and add uh, to 4. So what multiplies to 60? Uh, 20 and 3? That's not going to add to 4, right? No way. Um, 4 and 15? That's, that's not going to add to 4. Wow, this is kind of tough. Ah, 6 and 10. Yes, 6 and 10 multiply to 60. So I'll put a 6 here and a 10 here. One of them has to be negative. Uh, the middle term is positive, so the smaller one is negative, the bigger one is positive. Yep, that works. You can check. Negative 6w, that's the middle term, and the outer term is 10w, and so they add to 4w. So let me write it again down here. We have w minus 6, w plus 10 equals 0. This gives us two possible answers w equals 6 and w equals negative 10, right? Pretty easy to see those are the choices and it can't be negative 10, right? Because you can't have a negative width, okay? So um, one of the answers, so the width is going to be 6 and what are the units? Uh, feet, I'll spell it, so feet and then the length is 4 plus w, so you just add 4 so the length will just be 10 feet, right? Because 6 plus 4 um, is 10, right? You just do 4 plus 6, and so you get 10. So kind of an interesting problem. Um, I hope this video has been helpful.